Before we start, a quick but crucial disclaimer. These tools are for educational purposes only. They're used by ethical hackers to secure systems, but in the wrong hands, they can cause real harm and serious legal trouble. Please use this knowledge responsibly. Today, we're diving into 10 of the most dangerous tools in Kali Linux, software that can both protect and destroy. We'll break down what each tool does, how it works, and why understanding them is key to defending against cyber attacks. Let's get started. Number 10 on our list is Metasploit, often called the Swiss Army knife of hacking for a reason. This tool is legendary in the cybersecurity world, and for good reason. Just like a real Swiss Army knife, Metasploit packs a huge variety of functions into one compact, powerful package. Metasploit automates the process of finding, exploiting, and maintaining access to vulnerable systems. Instead of spending hours or days searching for weaknesses and writing custom code, users can let Metasploit do the heavy lifting, making the process much faster and more efficient. With a massive arsenal of thousands of exploits and payloads at your fingertips, Metasploit can turn what used to be complex multi-step attacks into just a few simple clicks or commands. It's like having a digital toolkit that's always ready for any job. Security professionals rely on Metasploit to test and strengthen their defenses, simulating real-world attacks to find weaknesses before criminals do. On the flip side, attackers use the very same tool to break into systems and networks, making it a favorite on both sides of the cyber battlefield. One of Metasploit's biggest strengths is its constantly updated library. As soon as new vulnerabilities are discovered, they're quickly added to the platform, meaning the latest threats can be weaponized almost instantly. With Metasploit, attackers can take over servers, steal sensitive data, and even install persistent backdoors, all from a single, unified platform. It's a one-stop shop for both offense and defense in the cyber world. That's why Metasploit is often the very first tool both aspiring ethical hackers and cyber criminals learn to use. It's a foundational skill in cybersecurity education and a must-have in any hacker's toolkit. The sheer power and accessibility of Metasploit make it a true double-edged sword. In the right hands, it protects. In the wrong hands, it can cause chaos. If you want to truly understand how modern cyber attacks work, you need to understand Metasploit. It's the backbone of countless penetration tests and real-world breaches alike. Metasploit represents the automation of hacking, streamlining attacks, and defenses alike. It's not just a tool. It's a revolution that's changed the cybersecurity game forever. Up next, let's dive into how hackers actually find their targets and how you can spot the signs before they strike. Number nine is Nmap, the ultimate reconnaissance tool. Nmap scans networks to reveal devices, operating systems, open ports, and running services. It's the blueprint for any attack, showing hackers exactly where to strike. With stealthy scan options, Nmap can map out entire networks without detection. System admins use it to secure their networks. Attackers use it to find weaknesses. Without Nmap, hacking is guesswork. With it, it's precision. It's the foundation of almost every successful hack. Number eight is Aircrack Ang, the Wi-Fi password cracker. It captures wireless data packets and cracks weak passwords with brute force or dictionary attacks. If your Wi-Fi password is simple, Aircrack Ang can break in within seconds. It can also create fake access points, tricking users into connecting and exposing all their data. Once inside your network, attackers can target every device you own. Aircrack Ang exposes the fragility of wireless security. Use strong WPA2 slash WPA3 encryption and complex passwords to defend yourself. This tool proves that a password alone isn't enough. Wireless networks are a prime target, don't make it easy. Now let's talk about cracking passwords everywhere else. Enter Hydra. Number seven on our list is Hydra, a notorious brute force login cracker that's earned its reputation in the world of cybersecurity. Like the mythical beast it's named after, Hydra is relentless, multi-headed, and difficult to stop once unleashed. Hydra specializes in attacking online services, think email accounts, social media profiles, and remote servers, by rapidly and systematically guessing passwords one after another at lightning speed. It leverages enormous word lists, sometimes containing millions of possible passwords, and can launch hundreds or even thousands of login attempts simultaneously, overwhelming weak defenses. If a service doesn't have protections in place to block repeated login attempts, 
Hydra will eventually find the right combination and break in, no matter how long it takes. Security professionals use Hydra to test their own systems, searching for vulnerabilities before attackers can exploit them. But in the wrong hands, Hydra is a favorite tool for credential stuffing, using stolen passwords to break into multiple accounts. If you reuse passwords across different sites, you're making yourself an easy target. One breach can quickly lead to many, as attackers use the same password to access all your accounts. With automation, Hydra can compromise dozens or even hundreds of accounts in just a few minutes, leaving a trail of chaos in its wake. The lesson here is clear. Never reuse passwords, always enable account lockouts, and use strong, unique passwords for every site. These simple steps can make a huge difference in your security. Remember, Hydra is relentless and only needs to find one weak link in your defenses to succeed. Don't let that weak link be you. Brute force attacks remain devastatingly effective, and their frequency is only increasing as attackers become more sophisticated and automated tools become more accessible. But brute force isn't limited to online attacks. Now let's look at how attackers crack passwords offline, where different tools and techniques come into play. Meet John the Ripper, another legendary tool in the world of password cracking designed to break even the toughest password hashes. Number six is John the Ripper, the offline password cracker. John takes stolen password hashes and cracks them at lightning speed. It uses smart guessing, huge word lists, and brute force to reveal original passwords. Attackers use it after breaching databases. Defenders use it to test password strength. John can crack millions of passwords per second on powerful hardware. Weak or unsalted hashes fall quickly. The takeaway, use long, complex, unique passwords and ensure hashes are salted. John the Ripper shows just how vulnerable most passwords really are. If your password is weak, it's already compromised. Now let's move to web application hacking. Number five on our list is Burp Suite, a name that's legendary in the world of web security. This powerful tool is often considered the ultimate web application hacker's toolkit, packed with features that both professionals and enthusiasts rely on. At its core, Burp Suite acts as a middleman, intercepting and modifying web traffic between your browser and the internet. This means every request and response can be paused, examined, and changed before it reaches its destination. With this capability, attackers can manipulate requests, test for vulnerabilities, and see exactly how a website responds to unexpected input. It's a favorite for finding and exploiting flaws like SQL injection, cross-site scripting, or broken access control, issues that can lead to serious breaches if left unchecked. The proxy and repeater tools are especially powerful, allowing for precise, repeatable attacks. You can tweak a single request over and over, testing different payloads until you find a weakness. Ethical hackers use Burp Suite to find and report bugs, helping companies patch vulnerabilities before criminals can exploit them. But in the wrong hands, Burp Suite becomes a weapon. Criminals use it to steal sensitive data, hijack user accounts, and compromise entire systems. That's why it's an essential tool for bug bounty hunters and penetration testers who need to think like attackers to defend against them. With Burp Suite, even a simple web browsing session can be transformed into a full-scale hacking operation. It's not just about clicking around, it's about understanding how web apps work under the hood. Mastering Burp Suite requires skill, patience, and a deep knowledge of web technologies, but in the right hands, it's absolutely devastating. Today, web applications are everywhere, from banking to shopping to social media. Burp Suite reveals just how fragile these digital front doors can be, exposing weaknesses that most users never see. But web apps are just one part of the puzzle. Next, let's see how databases, the backbone of most websites, are targeted by hackers. Enter SQL Map, a specialized tool designed to automate the process of finding and exploiting database vulnerabilities. Number four is SQL Map, the automated SQL injection tool. SQL Map finds and exploits database vulnerabilities in web applications. Give it a URL and it'll detect flaws, extract data, and even take control of the server. It can dump entire databases, usernames, passwords, credit cards in minutes. SQL Map can sometimes upload files or gain full system access. Developers must sanitize inputs to defend against it. One weak field can lead to total compromise. SQL Map automates what used to be a manual, complex attack. It's a weapon of mass data theft. Protect your databases or risk losing everything. Now let's talk about digital eavesdropping. Number three is Wireshark, the network protocol analyzer. Wireshark captures and displays every packet on a network, revealing all data in transit. On unsecured networks, attackers can see everything, websites, images, even passwords if not encrypted. It's a vital tool for troubleshooting, 
but also for surveillance and data theft. Man-in-the-middle attacks become trivial with Wireshark. Always use HTTPS and a VPN on public Wi-Fi to protect your data. Wireshark makes the invisible visible, reminding us that someone could always be listening. It's a must-have for defenders, but a nightmare in the wrong hands. Now let's hack the human element. 10. Number 2 is the Social Engineer Toolkit, or SET. SET automates social engineering attacks, phishing, fake login pages, malicious files, and more. It clones websites, harvests credentials, and sends mass phishing emails with ease. SET proves that humans are often the weakest link in security. Even the best defenses fail if someone clicks a malicious link. Ethical hackers use SET to train and test employees. Attackers use it to breach organizations. Social engineering bypasses technical barriers entirely. SET is a reminder. Security is as much about people as technology. Almost every major hack starts with a trick, not a tool. Now let's see the ultimate information aggregator. 11. Number 1 is Maltego, the OSINT powerhouse. Maltego maps out people, companies, and infrastructure using public data. It connects names, emails, social media, servers, and more, building a complete digital dossier. Attackers use it for targeted reconnaissance. Defenders use it to understand their exposure. Maltego's visual graphs reveal hidden relationships and attack paths. It's used by law enforcement, pen testers, and unfortunately, cyber criminals. Information is power, and Maltego puts it all together. Before any attack, the smartest hackers start here. Your public data is a blueprint for attackers. Now, let's wrap up. That's our list of the most dangerous Kali Linux tools. Remember, this knowledge is for defense, not attack. Understanding these tools is the first step to protecting yourself and your organization. Stay curious, keep learning, and always use your skills ethically. If you found this valuable, like, comment, and subscribe for more cybersecurity deep dives. Stay safe, and see you in the next video.